Very good. So it's there. Very good. Very good. So I start with, with Joel. Joel, please tell me, Joel. How are you today, today, Joel? It was good. Thank you. Uh, a lot of things to do because we are in a wave. Uh, we are preparing for wave two in the project. So, yeah, a lot of things to do, preparing many deliverables and also making the project plans. Yeah, okay. so today okay. was a busy day. So it sounds like a really busy day, Joel. Okay. Joel, yes, what sir. time did you start working today? Um, sorry. What time what time did you start working today? Oh I start at seven seven a.m. Seven a.m. Okay. Yes. And what time um did you finish or what time are you planning to finish? I close uh the business at five because i could not anymore <laughs> obviously no because it's it sounds like really really too, too much well joel and tell me how was your day yesterday joel um yesterday was good um because we did not have many uh things or many meetings like today okay. so when the when the meetings are too many we don't have time to progress in the project and Obviously. yeah that generate more stress <laughs> and joel and how many meetings did you have today uh i have six meetings i guess six my god and yeah. how long were they uh one was for 30 minutes and two for 45 and the other three like yeah one hour something like that wow that's interesting okay <laughs> yes joel, good. joel and what did you do joel, to cope with stress uh normally i try to focus on the task and also when i feel so stress normally i start walking or sometimes i got out to run it's something that helped me to avoid the stress very good Joel. good excellent welcome Joel. Welcome. okay thank you Joel. what about oscar oscar how are you today today oscar hey i'm uh, sorry what was the question how was or how i how i am number, number one how are you and number two, how was your day today? Hmm. Um, fine, really tired because it's month end uh, for many companies and we are doing a lot of process and we have a lot of activities to finish, All to right. close with finance and books and those things, so it's stressing. Mm -hmm. And uh, how was my day? I think the same. <laughs> I, oh, started my day, really? I started my day as, uh, doing some swimming. Right. I went to the pool to swim for one hour or something. All right. uh, then I came, uh, just took my lunch, Very good. Uh, played with my kids, and then I started working. I work from home, so that's a good ah, advantage. Okay, that, that is something plus. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, hey. I don't waste time. And Oscar, do you like working from home or do you like working at the office? No, I prefer working from home. You don't waste time moving from one place to another exactly the waste time commuting no? commuting from yeah your... correct so it's here you <laughs> of course you, you need a good place to work you need to prepare a good place exactly. you need to have good light and uh you know gadgets and everything to make you feel comfortable you know exactly Oscar. i i i also because i also work from home uh in in the mornings from nine in the morning to 5 p.m i work in a university i was teaching this there okay and um, we began working um, online from the pandemic and they gave us the the option to go to the, to, to the university or to continue working online I, pre I i i prefer to to work online but as you said okay, okay i agree with you okay you need you need to have discipline okay to work on online from home and number two a good place a good and quiet place 
to work like that. Yeah, right. Because, uh, but they, you know what? Uh, in our, in our, uh, in this kind of works like, like IT, discipline yes. is like uh, since the beginning. You know, because mm -hmm. nobody actually is. There is no micromanagement here. You are responsible uh, okay. for your activities. Nobody is asking you, did you finish? Did you complete this? There is a time, there is time frame, and you need to complete it at that time. So oh, that's how it right. so If exactly. you are good on self-driving, then you won't have issues. Exactly. And I think that's what happened with us. <laughs> exactly, Oscar. Very good. OK, what about <laughs> this Miriam? Thank you, Oscar. Hello, Miriam. How are you, Miriam? Fine? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks. Excellent, Miriam. So, Miriam, tell us, share with us, Miriam. How was your day today? Sorry? How was your day today? I didn't get the word. <laughs> sorry. How, listen, 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 listen. How was your day today? Ah, uh, sorry. Yeah, Um, it was very busy. <laughs> I have. Oh, also. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, I have Um, the meeting to plan all the to the next two weeks so it was a little it was a very long meeting and a lot of things to talk about right. um and then i have some things to check and i uh, someone asked me if i can check something related with uh, some code and i was like uh, okay yeah <laughs> yeah no, so, no so problem some, some code meeting like a book yeah yeah oh. because she uh, the person didn't found where it was and and she told me can you check if you see something please and and we was checking together so yeah <laughs> it was a lot of time there i mean uh, what, what language was it uh Python, .net, or Dubai. it's uh, i'm working with salesforce so it is apex and javascript JavaScript, okay. JavaScript sometimes can, can be a really headache, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Good. Okay, Mia. So, I mean, and how long was the meeting? Two hours? Uh, yeah, two hours or two hours and a half. <laughs> My God, Miriam. Okay. I mean, did they give you a chance to stretch uh, your arms, to stretch your legs, to go and grab a, a glass of water? Yeah, they give us like uh, a break of 10 minutes. Uh, they give us two breaks, so it was great. <laughs> it was cool oh, to, to have. Very good. They gave us, they gave us two breaks. They gave us. Two breaks. Very good, Miriam. Very good. Okay. Thank you, Miriam. Very good. What about Felipe? How are you, Felipe? How are you day today, Felipe? Hey, everybody. Yeah, it was uh, busy. A lot of things to do, too. So. Okay. I had a lot of develop. I'm working with some programming languages like JavaScript, <laughs> for example. Oh, come on, okay. <laughs> and it was a lot of things to to develop in the in the front end piece from my oh. side. Oh, so, are you are you there on the front end? Yeah, I'm I'm both front end and back end. I'm okay. I'm a full stack developer. Oh, come on, Felipe. So you, your life must be really stressing all the time, huh? <laughs> yes, just oh. a little bit. <laughs> Come on, Felipe. Felipe, and what is your favorite language to program? I really like Java. Java, Java. one, Java language is I like a lot that language. It's, oh. It is like I really feel very comfortable working with that language. Okay, 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 okay. And and what about um .NET? Oh, .NET. <laughs> I I don't have a lot of experience working with that language, so. I have practiced like I don't know maybe like two three projects, but actually they are like sample projects. But yeah. I think uh, that language has a lot of things like Java. This is a object oriented programming language, so I yeah. think I can do a lot of things in .NET too. Very good, <laughs> good, excellent, very good, excellent. What about Diana? Hello, Diana. What's going on, Diana? How are you? Hi. I'm good, thank you. Welcome, Diana. Diana, tell us, how was your day today, Diana? Well, it, it was uh, very quiet because I'm on bench, means that I don't have uh, a particular or, uh, yeah, particular project now, but I need to uh, complete some internal uh, courses. 
Ah, ok, 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 ok. So, um, can you say that it was a relaxing day or a stressing day? Oh, it was relaxing, yeah. Just working on the uh, courses and that's it. Very good. And Tina, are you also working from home or on site? No, I'm working from home, yeah. From home, very good, excellent, excellent, very good. Okay, excellent. What about Angelica? Hello, Angelica, good afternoon, Angelica. How are you? Hi, doing well. Thank you. Good, Angelica. How um, was your day today? Uh, it was a busy day. Too many meetings. All right. You know, one after another. So I'm how tired. Okay, <laughs> Angelica. Angelica, how many meetings did you have? Um, today was like, um, like 11. <laughs> Really, Angelica? That, yes. that, that many? Really? <laughs> so, Angelica was like all day in meetings, yeah. right? Yeah. Come on, Angelica. And uh, how long were they? An hour? Like oh. 30 minutes. Uh, yeah. Between 30 minutes and an hour. Wow, Angelica. Yeah. That's too much, okay? That's too much. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Angelica, and the same question. What do you do, Angelica, to cope with the stress? um well i try to have like uh, different pauses during the day like you know grab some coffee or um play with my cat like just a few minutes and yeah. after work um i try to to go outside with my family and you know buy some groceries and things like that very good, very good. Uh, Angelica, um, <clears throat> how do you, I mean, do you work from home or on site? Yeah, I'm in, ho I'm in home office. All right. <clears throat> because and the office is in Querétaro and I'm, I live actually in the state of Mexico. Ah, okay, okay. And Angelica, um, what do you prefer, to work from home or on site? Um, I prefer home. Right. But sometimes it's necessary to, interact with others <laughs> so yeah <laughs> uh, okay so you don't like to be like isolated all the time yeah. well now i now i prefer to be online all right but my role i'm the part of the change management team so we work with people so it's necessary to interact with them to communicate or things like that to create those kind of um i forgot the word uh connections very so, good yes very good Angelica. very good excellent friends. very good very good okay listen i'm going to share the my board with you okay i hope you can access it if you are not uh, i mean i think nobody is on site now so it will be easy for you to access okay the link okay i'm going to share it here on the chat okay the board won't need any installation or, or any to download. Okay, you just click on it and it, it's it's um it's fully online. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to share the screen with you anyway. Okay. Okay. And it's here, okay. Obviously, today is August 28, 2024. This is the goal of today's classes. By the end of the class, the students will have learned some business vocabulary and grammar correctly and fluently, okay? Good. Here. Here we have this. Yeah. Miguel, can Here. I interrupt you? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, you mentioned that we were going to receive a link uh, for the homework or whatever, and I don't remember that have received that information. Ah, yes, no. That's going to be next week because I need to create your accounts in order to, to access the, the Tata website, okay? All right. Exactly. So yes, it's, it's in the process of creating. Okay. But, but yes, thank you to to, to remind. Okay. Thank you. Very, very, good, very good. Okay. So here, last class we were practicing. We were learning about these words. So using these words, complete this exercise. For example, loyalty, image, stretching, awareness, and name. Okay. For example, I, I will read number one. It says. These words are related to brand, okay? That was from that class, it says, no one recognizes our logo or a slogan. We need to spend more on advertising to rise 
Brand Awareness. Consumers who always buy Sony when they need a new TV are showing. A fashion designer who launches his or her own perfume is an example of, okay. Uh, the of Mercedes-Benz is such that its products are seen as safe, reliable, luxurious, and well-made and expensive. Okay, please there on your notebook please, or on a, on, a, on a Word file if you want to, okay? Let's complete them, okay? Don't, don't write, the ones who are able to access, and welcome to the board, okay? If you can access, don't worry, there on your, on your notebook or on your, on your file, please just write not the number and the, and the word, okay? For example, who, who can tell me number two? He says, I volunteer, please, who, who can read number two? Me. Consumers who always buy Sony when they need a new TV are showing loyalty. Loyalty, very good. Yeah. I will write that very good. Loyalty. Exactly. Very good. What about the next, my friends? What about anybody any 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 volunteer? Anyone? I can try. Very good, yes, good. A fashion designer who launches his or her own perfume is an example of stretching. Stretching, obviously, of brand, obviously, I will say here, brand stretching, okay? Very good. Brand stretching, very good. What about, uh, let's say, for example, uh, Angelica, please. Um, the name of Mercedes-Benz is such that its products seem as safe, reliable, luxurious, uh, well-made and expensive. Very good. What's okay. your opinion of, of, of Mercedes, Angelica? Do you think that it's really reliable, luxur luxurious, well-made and expensive? Well, expensive, yes, but what about the other features? You are on mute. Yeah. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. I ah, think... yes, yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I think it's 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 expensive and uh, luxurious, but not sure if it is. Well, probably it's reliable, but I don't know. <laughs> well, at the end, it's a machine. At the end, of... <laughs> <laughs> exactly. That, that, that is a um cruel description okay but it's, it's it's true okay very good my friends excellent okay let's see let's see what about the next one okay it says launch okay life cycle range placement and endorsement all of these words are related to product for example we read it says george clooney advertising espresso is an example of a um, consists of introduction growth maturity and decline Tesco's white means that it appeals to all sectors of the UK market. The use of Aston Martin cars and Sony computers in James Bond films are examples of. For example, who, who can tell me number one, my friends? Number one is super easy. It's endorsement. Exactly, endorsement, very good, here, yeah. endorsement, very good, okay. When I saw that, I remember yes. a movie when he's dancing Al Pacino with Don Cacino, do you remember that movie? I think yes, I think yes, okay, it's, it's, like, it's like a interesting example, okay, excellent, okay. What about the uh, number, number six? Who can tell me number six? Um, Lunch. Consists of introduction, growth, maturity, and decline. Oh, what my bad. Life me? cycle. Exactly. Um, life cycle. Very good. Here. Yeah. Life cycle. Very good. Obviously, a product, a product life cycle. No? Yeah, very good. What about number seven? Who can tell me number seven? Tesco's white. Tesco's white. What about your friends? Okay. 
means that it appeals to all sectors of the UK market. I think it's Tesco's wide uh, product range means Maybe. that it appeals to all sectors of the UK market. Exactly, product range, okay? Well, I want to just range, okay? But exactly, good. What about the last one, my friends? The, the use of Aston Martin cars. Mm. Good. Mm. 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 The use of Aston Martin cars and sunny computers in James Bond film are examples of launch. Mm, maybe, maybe. I will say this one, okay? Look at this. I will say placement. 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 Exactly, a product placement. Why? Because they are trying to place the, the products, okay? in luxury productions okay so people people can understand the message that if they use them okay they will be as luxury as these products okay excellent reference very good okay look look at the next one anyways these words are related to market it says leader research share challenger and segment for example i will read microsoft is the in computer software in countries with aging populations the over 60s age group is becoming an increasingly important Pepsi is the incarbonated soft drinks. Focus groups and consumer service are ways of conducting. Uh, no, number nine is super easy, my friends. Who can tell me number nine? Um, Microsoft is the leader in yeah. computer software. Very good. The leader, very good. In computer software. Do you agree with, with this idea, my friends? Do you really believe that Microsoft is the leader in your software? I think I it's the most sale. Else. So if we are talking about uh, incomes, yeah, I think so. Very good. OK, OK, OK. That, exactly. That is a good perception, OK? Depending on the incomes. Very good. OK, so I'm going to okay, wait a minute, OK? If my boat is loading again. Very good. Oh, what happened to the board? Wait a minute. Very good. Oh, it's loading. Why? Very good. Wait a minute. Very good. In the meantime, please, Hector, please, Hector, tell us, Hector, how are you today, today Hector? Welcome to the class sector. How are you day today? Hello, yes, I am in class. Thank you so much. Well, my day today is a really busy, but really, really yes, busy today. Why, really busy. Well, why? Because well, I have meetings since the, the morning until now. Well, I, I have my, from, my last meeting at from five the morning. o'clock. From the morning. Yeah. From the morning. From the morning. On the morning. Yeah, from from the excellent. You. How many minutes did you have today? Five, six, three. I don't know. Today, how many meetings? Yes. Yes. Well, I have two meetings with clients, and I and I have four meetings, uh, or internal meetings. Then I have six meetings today. My God, that is crazy. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm okay. <laughs> I should be. I survive. I, I survive. I survive. I survive. I survive. <laughs> Hector, <laughs> and what, the thing. Excuse me. His internet connection is something wrong. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Very good. Okay, okay, very, very good. So let, let let's continue. Well, okay. I don't know. okay, okay. Let's continue with the activity, okay? It says, who can tell me okay. number 10, okay? In countries with aging populations, who can give it a try? Any important segment. Very good, increasingly important segment. Obviously, market segment. Very good, okay, there it is. Okay, excellent. Power the next, my friends. Pepsi is the 
Inter Miami. Challenger. Market Challenger. Is the market very good. Challenger, very good. Excellent, friends. Challenger. Well, good. we could say Pepsi is the leader and Microsoft is the challenger, right? Also, exactly, exactly, exactly. We, we can we can exchange, okay? Depending on your perception, okay? <laughs> that is because you love Microsoft and, and I don't. No, really? <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, okay. What about the, the last one, my friends? Focus groups and consumer surveys are way of conducting research. Very good, research, very good. Research. Okay. Excellent, friends. Very good. So this was was super easy for you. Okay. Very good. So no problem. Okay. Okay, my friends. So listen, let let's remember this topic. Okay. What are who can tell me, my friends? Who can tell me a good definition for phrasal verbs? What, what are phrasal verbs in English, my friends? Who can tell me that? I don't know. That's why I'm here. <laughs> Very good. Okay. Yeah. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, I'm kidding. Um, uh, there, <laughs> there are. Um, if, if I'm not confused, then it's yes. when um, it's they are. Well, I remember that they're like uh, it's a verb and a preposition. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Basically, they are verbs. Okay, made of with verbs and prepositions okay very good okay who can tell me my friend how many types of phrase verbs are there how many <clears throat> how many types in general all of them are classified into how many types i was not in that call so sorry <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Who can remember, my friends? Oh. No, I, I don't remember. Wait, don't worry. Uh, I, I would say Miriam is going to tell us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, basically, there are three types. No, number one is look at this separable. Okay, separable phrasal verbs. The second category or type is. Uh, Number two is non-separable, okay, okay, and and the last category is adjectives. Uh, it's three word, three word phrasal verbs. Okay, for example, my friend, separable. Okay, separable phrasal verb is like this one. Okay, for example, look at this, hand out. What is hand out of friends? Who, who can tell me the meaning of hand out? Hand out. I imagine it when they are going to meet with uh, some friends. I don't know if, uh, if that is the meaning. That, that's hand out. Right? Ah, exactly. Hang that out. is hand that is uh, out. out. Ah, sorry. I confused. Look at this and hang out belongs to this category. Look at this. I'm going to change the color, okay? okay. <clears throat> hang out belongs to non separable phrase. <clears throat> but first, let's focus on hand out, my friends. Hand out, my friends, means this. this one, okay? To give one, okay, of something, okay, to every person. Who can tell me the meaning in Spanish, my friends? <clears throat> repartir very good repartir. distribuir, distribuir. Oh. very good for example you can say this um, i will hand out them brochures why is brochure my friends could you say brochures in spanish brochures i don't know Triptico. Triptico. Very good. Triptico. Yeah. Typical. Very good. Very good. Okay. Look at this. I will hand out the brochures. Look at the position of the object. My friends. Look at this. Okay. Look at where the object is. Okay. <clears throat> the brochures. Okay. But you can also say like this. Okay. I will. I will hand the brochures out. Here, friends. The brochures. Okay. 
Look at the position, okay? That is why he has a parable. You can write them at the end, okay, or in the middle between the verb and the preposition. And both so this, are correct. It's like yeah. both are correct. There is one possibility, there's one more possibility. For example, this one, okay. I will hand them out. Look at this reference, okay. This word, okay, then it's called object pronoun. Why object pronoun? Because the, they are used to replace objects, okay, like here. Instead of saying brochures, okay, I change for them. But the rule says, my friends, when you use object pronouns, they always must be in the middle. Never like this, like this, for example. I will hand out them. This one, no, okay, this is a mistake, okay? So that's why they are called separable phrase verbs, okay? And there are many, many types of separable phrase verbs, okay? This is just one, uh, an easy example, okay? Number pick up, two is, it's, pick up I, it's one, right? It's exactly, it's, 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 a, it's a good example, okay? Pick up, okay? Okay, what is pick up, my friends, in, in Spanish? How is it pick up in Spanish, my friends? Any volunteer? Recoger. Recoger, very good. Who can tell me one example using this phrase of verb? I'm going to go to pick my daughter up. Very good. I will, I will say, I will pick up my daughter, okay? From school, I don't know, maybe, okay. I will pick up my daughter from school. Who can change it? Let's say one, one of the years, please. Uh, uh, um, with the same phrase? Exactly, but uh, changing in the middle, okay? Oh. Like, I will pick my daughter up from school. I will pick, very good, my daughter, okay, up from school. Exactly. And what about the last op option? What is the last option? Okay? What is the last possibility? I will pick her up from school. Very good. I will pick her up from school. Exactly. That is a good example. Pick up is also a separable preserver. So during my class, my friends, little by little, I don't know why, but but the book won't change, um, sorry, won't, won't show any use of preserver so far. But in my opinion and in my experience, is a good um, activity, is good advice to teach the students little by little how to handle and how to learn preserver. Why? Because they are very common in conversation. They are very common in, in in informal and formal writing and in informal and informal speaking okay okay look at the next category non-separable hang out for example you can say i will hang out with my friends today okay or you can say like this i will look at this I will hang out with them today. Look at the change, my friends. With non-separable phrasal verbs, okay, look at the object here. My friends, that is the object, okay? And we can change them, obviously, with the object pronoun. And look at how the rule change, okay? Here, here, okay, we cannot separate, okay? So, so we can use them, okay, at the end like these ones no okay separable no but with non-separable yes okay very good how we know what are separable and what are not how how do we know how do we know how do we know well, good question okay <laughs> these my friends <laughs> this topic is also memory okay the same when you learn the, the verbs in present the verbs in past and the verbs, the verbs in past participle the same goes here, okay? Just memory, okay? There is no rule, okay? If you tell Miguel, but what is the rule? Or explain the rule to us. There is no rule, okay? Just here is, um, at some point in life, American people or British people decided that there were three categories, and they put some verbs here, some verbs on non-separable, and some verbs on three word phrase of verbs. So this is just memory, okay? All right. Very good, friends. Now let's see this one, three word phrase of verbs, for example, this one. 
You will refresh every like this one, okay? There is. Put up with. Who can tell me what put up with is, my friends? In Spanish. How will you say put up with? Put up is colocar, no? Como colocarlo. Very good. Put up, exactly, exactly, exactly. That is put up, okay, exactly. But here we have put a wit. What is that put a wit, okay? This offense, put a wit means tolerate, okay? It's similar to tolerate. For example, you can say, I have to put up with uh, all this stress. Okay, I have to put up with all this stress. Or, or like this, okay, I have to, I have to put up with it. Okay, I think I have someone on the entrance, let me check, okay. Very good. Okay, let, let, let me share the screen again. Okay. So uh, in, in this model, of course, also we have many, okay. Something something hard with phrase verbs, my friend, is that um, maybe you know the, 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 the verb, maybe you know the um, preposition, but the meaning is totally different. For example, who can tell me, who can tell me what is the meaning of this one, my friend? Put off. Poner. What is that in, in Spanish? Put poner, okay. But the combination of put off. Why is that in, in, in Spanish, my friends? Put off. It's like a uh, postpone. Exactly. Similar to, very good, to postpone. Very good. For example, you can say the manager, okay, will put off the meeting. Exactly. Or the manager will put the meeting off, or the manager will put it off. Okay. So, little by little, my friends, uh, in, over the classes, we are going to learn, okay, phrase and verbs, okay? And let's start, ah, here, my friends, any questions about these three categories? Something not very clear? No. It's, it's no. clear. It's about memory, right? Uh, exactly, just about, exactly, memory, okay? For example, let's begin with these 12, okay? For example, I, I, I will read this. Stand out to be noticeable or distinctive. Take off. To become successful or popular quickly, chat catch on, to become popular or widely accepted, roll out to launch a new product or service, break into to enter a new market or sector, keep up, is to stay current with trends and competition, turn around to improve a struggling business or brand, build up to increase or develop a brand's presence, reach out to connect with customers or stakeholders. Follow up to check in with customers after a purchase or inter or interaction. Give back to contribute to the community or social causes. Phase out to gradually discontinue a product or service. For example, I will tell you for example for start out. For example, you can say all products. You can say all products. Okay stand out okay from others okay our products stand out from others okay my friend, so if you want okay there on your notebook or, or on a word file whatever you have access please only 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 please copy and copy the face of verb okay don't copy this okay just copy the face of verb and i will tell you if they are separable or non-separable, okay? And obviously all of these phrases are related to business. They are divided into two main categories, general English phrasal verbs and business English phrasal verbs. 
all of them okay are business phrase numbers okay okay i will start okay so obviously number one stand out that is non-separable oh i think i have someone at the end wait a minute okay very good okay so here okay listen i will take the attendance for eduardo and uh, hector very good welcome my friends how are you today fine fine thank you very good I think fine thank you very good welcome welcome to the classroom how was your day today my friends eduardo it was good sorry for the delay but i was uh, arriving for the doctor we had oh, an appointment oh. with my kid all right very good don't worry okay well, well hector how are you hector how are you day today hector well i am really fine my day very was good. really busy well, busy. I, 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 I was uh you gonna get me to the doctor I know the, we cannot hear you, Hector. <laughs> and I have the problem with the headset. So, okay, so, okay, okay. Can you hear me now? Yes, of course, yes. Okay, well. I said I, I, I was using the cell phone to connect or to join the meeting, but I, I have a little problem because I can't see the, the text. Then I change to use the PC. Very good, very good. Very yeah, good. Thank okay. you. Okay. Very good. okay, welcome, my friends, to the class. Okay, okay, so let's continue. Okay, so it's here. Yeah, okay, obviously, take off, my friends, take off is a parable. Take off has many meanings. Okay, uh, that is another uh, thing, my friends. Some phrase verbs are multiple or have multiple meanings depending on the context. This one, take off here for businesses to become successful or popular quickly. For example, you can say. Our products, our products, or, or the company's products, okay, are planned to take off soon. Okay. So take off is the parable. Catch on. Catch on is non separable. Okay. Roll out. Roll out is separable. Break into. Break into. Okay. Break into is separable. Keep up. Keep up is separable. Turn around. Turn around is separable. Build up. Build up, okay. That is also separable. Turn around is separable. Exactly. Turn around is separable. Can you, can you give me an example? For example, it says, remember the meaning, to improve a stroke in business uh, or brand, okay? For example, you can say, we need to calm the situation or the, for example, you can say, the company, okay, situation around for the best. I'm going to make it smaller, okay? I'm going to put it huh. here. Okay, here, okay. okay. We need to turn the company situation around for the best. Well, remember, today is to improve or a struggling business, okay, to improve a struggling business or brand. So maybe here at the company we have uh, some kind of issues, okay, some kind of problems, okay. So we need to turn them around, okay. Very good, okay. Build, build I'm going to, okay. There is build up. Build up, that is separable. Reach out, separable. Follow up, okay, follow up. Okay. That is separable. Follow up a, a customer, follow a customer up, okay, to check with customers after a purchase or interaction. Give back, give back, okay. That is also separable. And face out. Face out is also separable. 
Very good, friends. So only take off and send out. It's not it's not separable. From this list, exactly. Yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. Exact. Okay, my friends. So next activity, please. There on your devices, as you can go right, please. Number one, pick pick out pick out one of them. Okay, any one you want to, and please write one sentence like mine. Okay. So, uh, step one, pick out, okay, pick out one of them, okay, and then write up, write up, okay, a sentence, okay. Ah, look at this, uh, for example, this one, okay, look at this. Look at this, for example, write up, and we have write down, okay. W what is write, write up, my friends? They are also phrasal verbs. By the way, they are also separable phrasal verbs. What, what what is write up? Who can tell me write up in Spanish? Let's see. What about please, Eduardo? What do you think is Eduardo write up? I'm not sure. It's, I think it's something Very about write, but I'm not sure what all this it means. Very good. I will tell you. Write up, my friends. Redactar. Write up, redactar. Very good. Write down, anotar. Okay. Or escribir. Okay. Very good. So, activity so, one. One okay. example is write up. When you are a, an essay, is you are writing up an essay? I or or an anime, for example. I, I'm gonna say I'm writing this. I'm writing up the email, okay, or the purchase order. Mm -hmm. this one, okay. I'm writing up the email for the purchase order, or okay. I'm writing uh, the email up. I'm writing the email up for the purchase order. Or, or, exactly, or, or with, what is the difference without the up writing? I write is just like uh, the, the base uh, form of, 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 the, of the verb. You can also say like, like that, okay? I'm writing the email, okay, for the pushes order. However, however, it sounds more natural. Okay, more natural when, when speaking or writing, okay, writing, it gives the emphasis that you are, okay, um, typing all information, okay, that, that you are developing the, the email. Well, writing is also correct, okay, but if you want to sound more professional in English, okay, more advanced in English, we will say, I'm writing up the email, okay. Grammatically, both are correct, okay, but this, this one sounds more, more professional, okay. And this one sounds more, more like a more basic, okay? Very good. Okay, okay, so activity one. Pick out one phrasal verb, any of them, and please write one sentence, okay? And I'm going to, look at this, I'm going to share a file with you. So I hope everyone everyone can, can join the file in order to make it uh, more, more collaborative, okay? So wait a minute, I'm going to, Access one of the files. Uh, good. Okay, there it goes. In the meantime, please uh, try to think on one phrase that you would like to work with. And here on this file, please, let's write your examples. There it goes. Very good. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is there? Okay. There you go. So I'm going to share it now. Wait. Excellent. Okay. I'm going to say there on on the chat from from it. Okay. There it is. Okay. And you will be able to see this file, okay? Which it is going to be.
Okay, obviously, for example, please, please write your name, please. For example, I will write my name, for example, Miguel. Okay. Okay. And under my name, please, um, you please write your, your sentence, okay? For example, okay, and then let me pick out another one. For example, keep on, um, build up, for example, build up. You can say like this, okay? You can say the company, okay, needs to build up. Okay, it needs to build up. Okay. This product on the market. Okay. The company needs to pick to build up this product on the market. Okay, I'm going to share my screen. You can see. Very good. And this one is okay, build up. Build up again. Okay. Very good. Felipe, Apple will roll out the iPhone 16 in two weeks. Apple will roll the iPhone 16 out in two weeks. Very good. Okay. Joel. Very good. Very good. Hmm. What about uh, uh, Diana? Can you access the, the file, Diana? Diana and um, and Miriam and Angelica. Can you access the file? Yes, I already had my. Ah, okay, okay. Very good. Excellent. Perfect. Good, good, good. Okay, good. It's okay. Very good. So jo Joel wrote wrote many examples. Okay, he said the company is. No, uh, I only type one, but I don't know what happened. One? Okay, okay. So you you typed in um, the companies use strategies to give the society back that one. No, I put the other ones. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Okay, so remember, please write, write your, your names, okay, so that I can know who is writing, okay? Yeah, as I say, I only type the next one out my name, yeah. Very good. Very, very good. Very good. Okay. Well, uh, I have a question. Or yes. I have a doubt here. For example, Miguel, uh, yes. when I said my team, my team is or my team are, because, well, I know my team has a... a many people no Good or question. two or three people then i i, I need to set my team is or my team are good, good good question okay grammatically is singular my team is building up why because you cannot say the plural my teams are working to fix uh, maybe you, you are you are a manager okay and you have several teams working for you for example, you have the IT team, you have the finance team, you have, for example, I don't know, I, I'm going to make it up, okay, the, the ecology team, okay? So it grammatically is singular. Why? Because that, that word has, has plural. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Good, good yes, good, good, good. Angie, after our session, I will send a follow-up email, okay? To summarize the conversation and action items. Very good. You were the companies use strategies to give the society back. Very good. And this one is who? I follow up the last agreements. Yes, that's mine. Okay, this one and the next ones. Okay. And what about I will okay. Could you please write, write your name there, please? Hector. Hector. Okay, I will I will talk. Okay, for you. Okay. Hector. Very good, Hector. Good. Okay. Miriam, okay. He says, I reach out the user to check the requirements. Very good. Oscar, the company needs to put up with the recession. Very good. Very good. Who else is missing, my friends? I think it's missing 
my goodness, I think it's missing media. I don't mean them, no, okay. Wait, it's okay. I think it's missing Diana, but Diana said that she cannot access. Ah, okay, okay. So, Diana, don't worry. Could you please tell me your example, Diana, and I will write it down, please? I think she yeah. lost the connection. She was here exactly. a little time ago. Okay, I think she's back. Okay. Very good. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. What about uh, Eduardo? Eduardo, can you type in Eduardo? Were you able to access Eduardo? Yes, but I can see your uh, your screen. Okay, don't worry. Are you sure? I will share it. Very good. Just, 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 just. Okay. Very good. Teacher, what up with what up with can be used with a person? Yes, for example, <laughs> but that would be very, very um, not impolite, but very rude. Okay, for example, I. I need to put up with my brother, okay? Or I need to put up with the manager. Yes. Yeah, it's but not it's, um, it's correct, it's okay. and it's like okay. it'll be, it will make you look like a good speaker or not. Like um, <laughs> well, in that sense, it will make you look like a like a <laughs> you you are showing your your, your real feelings towards okay. the person, okay? Okay. But obviously, you, you you are not insulting the person. Okay, it's, it's not an insult. Okay, it's just like show, showing your real feelings. Okay, <laughs> very good. Okay, my friends. So, okay, I will read for Joy. The company is use strategies to give the society back. Hector, I, I follow up the last agreements that we agreed with. I will say with the client. Okay, with the client, we roll out the car. Watch service today. I will reach out Jane to talk about the contract. But my team is building up our presence with client. With I will say with the client, okay? With the client or with the client, in turn. Meaning I will reach out the user to check. I need, so sorry, Hector. I need to include the the client D. Exactly. Okay. If you want to speak about the specific clients, yes. If you want to speak about general clients. Is only with clients. Uh -huh. No, that's that's okay. Thank you. Very good. So I will reach out the user to check the requirements. Oscar, the company needs to put up with the recession. Exactly, my friends. Very good. Excellent. Very good. So I think that that was easy for you. Okay. Now, my friends. Okay. Let, let's continue. I'm going to share the my screen again, okay? and let's continue with the next topic, which is also a challenging topic. Okay, for more for everybody. This one, my friends. Okay, I'm going to look at this. I'm going to release one. These, my friends, they have a technical name. They are called idioms. Okay. Idioms, my friends, are phrases that are all together all the time and that they never change the meaning. Okay. Idioms belong to a category, to a category of words called. Like this, okay. Collocations. Collocations, my friend, are words or phrases that are always together, okay, and they always have the same meaning, and you cannot change them, okay. For example, this one: think outside the box to be creative and innovative, get the bar, get the ball rolling to start a project or initiative, rise the bar to set higher standards or expectations, cut corners. To do something in a cheaper or easier way, often compromising quality. By the bullet, to face a difficult situation with courage. Keep the ground running, to start a project with enthusiasm and energy. Jump on the bandwagon, to adopt a trend or popular idea. In the driver's seat, to be in control of a situation. Burn the midnight oil, oil, okay, to work late into the night. Throw in the towel. To give up on a project or idea, call the shots to make the decisions. Back to the drawing board, okay, to start over after a failure. For example, look at this. Think outside the box. Or or also also think, think out of the box. Think. I'm sure you have seen this one, okay? Think out of the box. For example, 
Okay, you can say, for example, for the new, look at this, for the new product, okay. Okay. We need to think, okay, out of the box, okay, to make it a success. So, what is he, this one, okay, to, we need to think out of the box, we need to be creative and innovative, okay, to, to make it a success, okay. Also, my friends, remember, okay, this is also difficult. Why? Because they are idioms and they never change. So they always have the same meaning and the same as phrasal verbs. These idioms are especially for business, okay? There are others, others which are for general English, okay? Okay, so please write down, please, these phrasal verbs, sorry, these idioms, okay? Okay, on your note, press. Don't, 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 don't copy all of these, okay? Just, just write down the the idiom, okay? On your notebook or on your, okay, writing devices. But we can change the time, right? Exactly. Sorry, the tense. Yes. Exactly. The tense, exactly. For example, remember, they are phrases, so you can mix them with present, past, future, present, perfect, past, continuous, okay? What, whatever you decide, okay? Okay, I'm going to throw in the towel of this class. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to throw in the towel, okay? Okay, I'm going to throw in the towel, okay, for, for this class. For this class. For this class. <laughs> okay, very good. Yes, we need to Okay, friends, ready? Mm. Very good. Okay, good, good, good. good. Okay, let's wait for the others, okay? Uh, sorry, um, yes. can you repeat the pronunciation of the number seven? Jump on the bandwagon. Jump on the bandwagon. Okay, thank you. It's different to adopt a trend or popular idea, okay? Mm -hmm. Very good. For example, you can say this, for example. One example is this, the company, or the enterprise, okay, will jump on the bandwagon, okay, 
for the new trends in marketing. An enterprise will jump on the bandwagon for the new trends in marketing. It means that the company will adopt the new ideas for, or the new tendencies for marketing. Thank you. Very good. Okay, once again, there on the side on the share file, please pick out pick out one idiom, please, and please write one sentence using the idiom. Okay. Remember, uh, as uh, we said before, okay, you can create it in the past, in the future, present perfect, okay, or or anything you want to, okay. Okay, so uh, I back to to the fine to the. Share file, okay. And, and, the, okay. and uh, our name, exactly. Please, exactly. We will just yes. here on, on the idiom section, okay. And please, also there, there, write, write down, please, your example, okay. I'm going to share the screen again, okay. There it goes, okay. Very good. Very good. So remember, pick pick one, pick one, okay. Pick it up, and please okay, write one sentence using one item, okay. So in the current position, I'm trying to raise the bar, okay. I will say here, here in order to, to raise the bar for sorry. Mm. For the KPIs, okay, for customer service. Very good. That, that, that's a good example. Good. And Jean. Very good. Very good. Very good, Angie. To solve the problem in the project, the team had to think outside the box and come up with an innovative solution. Hector, now he's really in the driver's seat. After the discussions, I will say, Hector, it is, it is time to call the shots. Hey, everything has a solution. It's time to bite the bullet. That's your turn to get the ball rolling. Very good. Miriam, okay, I threw in the towel with, very good. Joel, the company had to call the shots during the project plan meeting. Very good. Oscar, I'm going to burn the midnight oil due to the project deadline. Oscar, I have a question for you, Oscar. Do you like Oscar? Do you do you like to burn the midnight oil, Oscar? <laughs> it's not a joke, right? <laughs> <laughs> but, no, uh, I mean, uh, I think there are days that you have to do it, right? Exactly. Because, like I said, we're working from home, so there is like a s extra responsibility on on the project, and uh, we have to sometimes stay late. Very good, very good, good, good. Mira, I threw in the towel with the bug. Very good, Mira. Oh, Miriam, how often, Mira? How often do you throw in the towel, Miriam? Um, it's very common. Then I wait a couple of. Uh, I mean, after the towel, I wait like thirty minutes, and then I start again. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Very good. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Friends. Excellent. Friends. So, homework for next class obviously is going to be to learn. Okay. I'm going to share my screen. Okay. Wait a minute. There it goes. Okay. Homework for next class, friends, is number number one: memorize. Okay. Learn by heart. Okay. These five tablets. Also memorize or learn by heart and these idioms. Mm -hmm. Why? Because we'll do an activity based on them. Okay. Very good. 
Here, my friends, any question about these phrasal verbs or about these idioms? Something not very clear, my uh -huh. friends? Uh, in my experience, I used them, some of them in the past, without knowing this um, technical knowledge, I guess, okay. just because of the experience uh, talking with other people from US, especially. Okay, so, so you, you, you were in search so certain about the meaning? I would think of sight of the box and uh, throw the, the towel, call the shots. They use it like the native speakers, they use it every day. Exactly. And we learn something, and I think we repeat just that now we know uh, how yeah. or why, right? Exactly. That is why, my friends, they are important to learn because native speakers, for them, it's so natural, okay, to use face verbs or to use idioms, okay? So that's the way they do it, okay? Excellent, friends. Very good. Okay, so let, let's continue also with the book. Here it says, this discuss this question okay i will read number one it says what are the advantages and disadvantages for companies of product endorsements how can companies create brand loyalty can you give any examples of successful or successful brand stretching think of a cheap or expensive idea for a product launch what other market segments can you identify eg what is eg my friends for example it says eg young singles but what is the meaning of reference for EG? Example given. Look at this. EG. Example given. Okay, let, let me wait. Okay, for example here. Okay, example given. But, but remember, in English, in English, it will be given example, right? Mm -hmm. In English, in Spanish, it is we like him. Un ejemplo dado. I think it will be give an example. Okay. But that is not the real meaning, friends. Okay? Who, who can tell me the meaning of EG, my friends? Who knows? For example, right? Yes, I mean, that is the meaning, okay? But what does the E stand for? Ah, look at this one. There's another idiom. Look at this one. Stand, is stand it, for. It, is it late? Late in. Is the stand for is a um, is is obviously a, is a non-separable phrase of verb. And exactly, it is in Latin. It is That's Latin. True. And it's like, and do you know what it means? <laughs> no, but I think it's Latin. Okay. In Latin. Very good. Exactly, that is exemplary Grisha. Exemplary ah. Grisha. That is EG, exemplary Grisha. But in English, okay, uh, when in Latin is, um, okay, ejem ejemplo dado, ejemplo otorgado, okay, that is Latin. Uh -huh. But in English is, for example, okay, example. So there you write it down, okay, EG means exemplary Grisha. Okay, okay. so here for so English, is, Latin. Exactly, it's Latin, but they they took it from from Latin to use it into English. Okay, very good. Yeah, which is John Singles. Okay, <laughs> it says, what action can companies take if they start to lose market share? Okay, question for example. Okay, let me let me see the, the question for Oscar. Oscar, what are the advantages Oscar, and disadvantages for companies of product endorsement? Okay. Just just please tell me just one and one. Okay. Disadvantage and advantages for companies of product endorsement. Product huh? endorsement. Good. Just tell me one advantage, Oscar, and one disadvantage. Product endorsement is like uh, use the same product with another brand or something. I remember. Who can tell me, my friends, what is product endorsement? Do you remember? Or is someone yes. Yes. Oh, yeah, 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 right. right. Uh, exactly. I got confused. Uh, oh, yeah. I think advantage is uh, if they can give you a good, uh, um, a, a good, um, 
publicity. Uh, I mean, sorry, uh, the, uh, I forgot the word. Uh, you can get a good um, get um, good advertisement, good positioning. Advertising and no, but there is another word for uh, um, uh, marketing. Maybe it's good, good for marketing. Good mar for, yeah, okay. and, and and it depends on the person that you you choose. You can have a good. Uh, for example, uh, if I if I have water, and I took Cristiano Ronaldo or some good um, football uh, player, then I can get a you know a good image, and my my product can can sell because he represents a, a sport guy, right? But um, okay. I think the advantage is, is on the other good. in the other way, right? If you pick up, I don't know uh i would just say a name um <laughs> any uh, fat guy uh, uh, in uh, the world uh, <laughs> uh, a, a non-famous a, a non person yeah but even if it's famous you're announcing water you need a fit guy and if you choose i don't know uh, uh someone fat it's not good for your image right i that that's my like uh the point of view, okay. right? Okay, it's, it's true, it's true. Okay, very good, 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 good. Okay, so what about please, uh, Angelica? Angelica, how can companies create brand loyalty? Angelica, what's your opinion, Angelica, about creating mm. brand loyalty with customers? Uh, it could be with the uh. With, oh I'm thinking on that actually, but uh, with the well, if the if the products are um, good and and the good evolution of the marketing, um, there needs to be a how was a reliable. Uh, product um, with good, with good quality and well, I think so. Mm. Well, yeah, I think it's carrying the good quality of the products. I don't know if it is just me or he's gone. We lost me. I think so. Yes. <laughs> Internet connection issue. Hey, Miguel Angel isn't in the, in the call. Well, he has an issue. I think we can take the picture and well <laughs> <laughs> because I think he's not going to be back. Oh. I 
Oh, sí, pues sí. Ah, chido, carnal. Sí, no, pues ahora sí que... Órale, sí, carnal, gracias, ¿eh? Órale, chido, bro. I think in the, in the chat, in the WhatsApp, Angie is writing. <laughs> ah, you are angry. Am I angry? <laughs> well, so sorry. I think another Angie was. <laughs> I think what's it was today. me. <laughs> oh, and I was really <laughs> excited. Like, oh, we will have an answer. What's Miguel? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, don't worry. Oh, All well, right. Ox, Ox is writing now, yeah. And about your question, Angelica, about the loyalty, I think almost all the company use the points right now. Do you remember when you buy something with your credit card, you get, I don't know how many points for mm. purchases. Yeah, I think it's one of the most common part now. Yeah, you're right. He's back. <laughs> we can Hello, hear you, yes, sir. You're back. We can hear you. You're back, but yeah, actually. We we can yeah, hear okay. you. Yes. I, I'm sorry, yeah. my friends. We have to my internet. I don't know. It got disconnected. So let, let's, let's put it. I, I apologize for time, friends, OK? But yeah. that's why something happens, OK? Don't worry. Oh, OK, friends. Don't so, worry. Okay, so let, let, let's continue, okay, and before we finish, okay. Okay, we still already seven minutes, okay, let's say advance of these seven minutes, okay, and let's speak about yourself, okay, let's practice conversation. For example, what about this, Hector, Hector, what uh, what are you going to do this weekend, Hector? Do you have any plans, Hector, for, the, for this weekend? For the weekend? Yes. Yeah, well, my plans, I always have a plan. That's yeah, good, okay. I am a planner then I always have a plan. Then for the weekends, usually my plan is to be with my kids. All right. Usually, okay. not always I reach out that, but always is my plan. Very good, Hector. And where are you taking taking your, your kids, uh, Hector? Well, usually on, on on weekends, we we go to the, to the cinema theater, to the movies, or right. to the mall, yeah. Okay, we we'll spend okay. time, time together. Very yeah. good, very good, wonderful, wonderful. Good, good, good. What about Miriam? Miriam, what are you going to do this weekend, Miriam? Um, a difference of Victor, I am not from planning. <laughs> it's everything that it's happened. Uh, I don't know. Maybe um, uh, I want to watch a movie uh, in the cinema. So okay. maybe I will go, but uh, sometimes it's like, um, well, I also have like a pending book, so I don't know which of the two things is going to win. <laughs> I've got to the cinema or read a book, <laughs> but yeah. Okay, but what, what would you prefer? Uh, it's because the movie it's inspired or it was written uh based on a book ah, so that's okay. why i want to watch the movie but um i my pending book it's uh one of the most recent from this author so i am like i don't want to enter to tiktok or social media because there are a lot of new information about it and so i, I don't know <laughs> exactly a, a lot of spoilers right yeah 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 and i, I, and I don't want <laughs> exactly. no, I, I don't want 
<laughs> Very good. Okay. What about Joel? What, what, what are you going to do this weekend, Joel? This weekend, um, I'm going to be with my uh, mother-in-law. Normally, we go one week with my mom and another week with my mother-in-law. And then, and sometimes, I get out with the uh, with the friends. But this week is with my uh, family-in-law. What I'm going to be with my very good. Okay, very good, good, good. What about Diana? What are you going to do this weekend, Diana? First of all, my apologies, but I'm having some issues with my uh, internet connection. So that's why I <laughs> try to log in multiple times. Good, good. Uh, don't worry. For uh, my planning for this weekend is just to, uh, I will take my dog for uh, grooming. Okay, that's good. Excellent, excellent, Diana. Very good. Okay, okay. Okay, what about Angelica? What are you going to mm -hmm. do? This weekend, Angelica. What is your plan for the weekend? Mm, for Saturday, I plan to sleep late. <laughs> okay. For Sunday, uh, it's my uncle's birthday. He is in his fifties. Very good. So there's a, a party for that. Okay, good, good, Angelica. <laughs> Angelica, and what present are you going to buy for him? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Present. Why? Why, Angelica? That's enough. That's enough. <laughs> I just my present. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but that is a, a very costly. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, a very costly. <laughs> tea. Very good. Okay. What about you know? Uh, you know the Deloitte people time. It's pretty expensive. So exactly. if we spend with them, <laughs> we are giving a lot. And uh, it's Sunday, so yeah, it's a big <laughs> effort. <laughs> even more expensive, right? Exactly. <laughs> very good, Angelica, very good. What about Eduardo? What are you going to do this weekend, Eduardo? Also, as Angelica, I want to sleep uh, late, but I think it was not. It will be not be possible. So uh, maybe I'm going to run, and I say R, because it's uh, my wife and one of our friends. Oh, and right. maybe our plan will be Desierto de los Leones or something like that. Oh, that's cool. Okay, okay. Okay, very good, good. What about Oscar? What are you going to do this weekend, Oscar? I have no plans. I guess I am going to uh, grill something, carnita asada. Oh, uh, okay. Some okay. nice steaks and uh, some beers, get drunk. Some beer? And Yeah, get drunk and enjoy the weekend and that's it and uh, next week next week i am on vacation so uh, ah that's why oscar uh, i will i'm planning to go to the uh to the beach so okay. i won't what, be here <laughs> what what beach are you planning to, to visit oscar uh maybe puerto escondido puerto escondido okay yeah, it's, the, okay. it's the plan but uh, it depends on my wife and my kids exactly. so exactly. we are we, we need to take also the babysitter and uh, that's <laughs> uh, we need to check if she can also go goes with us she can go with us she can go with us she can go with us yes oh, yeah, very right. good okay my friends so that will be all for today thank you for being here okay mm -hmm. remember homework memorize phrases and verbs memorize mm -hmm. idioms okay next class we're going to do an activity based on that okay and thank you thank you my friends everybody okay have a great weekend please take care stay away it says stay away from for monkeypox, okay, and from COVID and from all those uh, combinations, okay. Yes, Anna, please. Hi. 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 I mentioned that I have some uh, internet connection issues, but I think I lost the URL you shared with us. Can you please share it again, maybe on WhatsApp? The recording for the video. No, 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 the other one. The, I think it was the... The links for the documents that we yeah. are typing. Ah, okay. Ah, okay, okay. Yes, 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 sure. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Uh, I'm going to share them on, on WhatsApp, okay? Yeah, thank you. Thank you. So, yes, thank, thank you. you. Yes, thank you. Take care, thank you, take care. Thank you very much. Thank you, take care. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you, bye. Thank you, bye.